<sighs> I literally love a fresh and clean home. I just I just love it so much. With that being said, thank you so much to Home Aglow for sponsoring this portion of today's video. So with being a new parent and then also just like going into the more busier time of the year for me, and I feel like for a lot of other people as well, it's been really hard for Cameron and I to balance every single thing that we need to get done between work, house cleaning, being in like a very attentive relationship with another, having family time with our other family besides like our in-household family. There's truly not enough hours in the day. And I came across this company called Home Glow that allows you to buy some time back. So one thing that I've learned in my adulthood is that time is money. If I can pay for a service that'll buy me some hours back in my day, I am all for it because honestly, those hours that I can spend while cleaning, I can use to work or spend time with my family or whatever the case may be. Cameron and Kyla are here. We are currently enjoying our freshly cleaned home by Homaglow. So Homaglow is super easy to book online. As you guys can see here, all you do is you put in your zip code and you'll find local cleaners. You just set the duration, how long you need them for, and the time time and date that you want them for. You could book them on a holiday basis, you could book them on a situational basis, or you can sign up for their Forever Clean membership, which will help you book ahead and save money for your future bookings. But we just had our house cleaned, and honestly, it feels so good in here. It makes me it really excited. It smells so good. It's just the fact that Home Aglow has five-star rated cleaners at super affordable prices that is gonna get me to keep rebooking. Something about Home Aglow that is very important to everybody who wants someone to come to their house and clean is safety. Home Aglow does a background check on all the cleaners to make sure they're reliable on cleaning your home in a safe manner. So Cameron and I are already pretty clean people. Like it wasn't really that much that our cleaner had to come here and do. As you can see the before and afters, it was just little stuff like our stove and like Kyla's bathtub. Those are all things that were super minimal, but our cleaner did it and made it look super sparkling clean. So if you want to take home cleaning off of your plate, make sure you guys go head over to homeaglow.com slash Trisha Cam, or you can scan the QR code right here on the screen to get your first home cleaning for only nine dollars nine dollars is crazy to have someone come to your house and do a deep cleaning a well excellent cleaning like this mm -hmm. for nine dollars is insane that's literally like less than my starbucks drink <laughs> but thank you so much to home aglow for making our home sparkly clean and sponsoring this portion of today's video what up ticket family welcome back to another lit video for the channel i'm not gonna lie first of all let's just say happy halloween let's get that off but every time we do videos like this try on videos i feel like they always end off with something after between me and you Ooh. like it, like why just like spill the tea like that it always like it just ends off with just greatness right? <laughs> okay. sometimes it's like hard to film these because just what happens like oh you know Trisha gosh. comes out she's slaying all these outfits she looks so good and it's like yo Halloween you know Halloween got some like five outfits for the females I ain't gonna lie and I know Trisha is just gonna kill and slay all of them so I ain't gonna lie I feel like this video is probably gonna go to somewhere. I don't know. I, I just don't know. Like, and especially like some of these outfits that Trisha said that, you know, I need to be prepared mentally and physically, and I need <laughs> to keep my hands to myself. Um, I'm very scared, and it, I ain't gonna lie, it's getting spooky. All right, babe. <laughs> Obviously, you guys already know that when I pull together some Halloween outfits, especially for these try on hauls, I like go all in with it. Like, I wanna make sure that like it's a full fit. Yeah. Listen, all, I, all I'm saying is I saw some fishnet, like, you know what I'm saying? Most so of them have fishnet. I'm guessing the yeeks is going to be out. I think the yeeks is going to be out. <laughs> and I don't know if this video is going to go full length. I just don't know. It, you know it's going to go full length. Uh, so she says but also guys we do want to say that this year i think we took we took a break from halloween like last year too i don't know we just have been off about halloween but you no know, this year we're dedicating it more and like focusing it more on kyla but next year when she can really like she, appreciate Halloween, when she has more senses and she's more developed in a way where she can like know what things are happening or she see things and understands things more that's when um, me and trish will do it. so we think that next year she'll be able to she'll be like a year and like like almost a year and a half actually yeah. next year we will be doing more halloween festival like festive things like but the costumes that trisha got is more for i ain't gonna lie like me <laughs> i ain't gonna lie. and for me honestly i love seeing myself like i love feeling myself like you ladies out there know it a lot of times for halloween actually i'm not gonna speak for every woman because every everyone's different girls dress up on halloween for themselves like they want to feel themselves they want to go out with their girls and stuff like that so i'm not gonna lie though but i saw like fishnets yeah so like that's already getting me like a the little fishnets got him. i don't know but it kind of looks like 
Trisha, I'm not gonna lie. She told me that she didn't spend a lot of money on these costumes, though. I don't know if like the costumes are cheap or anything, but and if they are cheap, you know what that means? Easily to rip off. Oh my gosh, babe! Like Ready? your I'm mindset. Not, all right, I'm not gonna say nothing. You know what I'm saying? The only thing I'm gonna say now is if you guys are new, make sure you guys subscribe button, mm -hmm. smash that like button, and comment down below what you guys rate these outfits. And, and if you missed the try on hauls, because this is like the first try on haul in like a year. I feel like we've done. Mm, yeah, we haven't done try on haul in a minute. All right, I'm ready. Um. Oh, I'm, you're always ready. Baby. I'm ready, but it's spooky. Yeah. All right, guys. So I'm gonna be rating all these outfits on this whiteboard right here. Trisha, come out. She has the first outfit ready. Let's see what we're working with for this Halloween. Little devil moment. Jeez. Remember, geez. remember how you said about like cheap costumes or whatever? Yeah, the choker broke as I was trying to put it on. Ooh. It was gonna get broken either way. Karen. I'm just keeping the beam with you. Obviously, if I was going out to a party or something. The white socks would dip. I'm loving how these got like little like crystals on it, uh -huh. little fake diamonds on it. Right. Like it's like a nice little glitter, little bling to like mm -hmm. the, the things around your legs. Mm -hmm. Loving that. Here's a I... mm. Oh man, Ouch. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a 10. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> you give this one a 10? Yeah, I'm gonna give that one a 10. So we're starting off with a 10. Yeah. This is a 10 for you? That is a 10 for me. That's crazy. People are gonna be like, oh, you only give it a 10 because you saw the yeeks. You're damn right. I saw them yeeks and I would put a 10. <laughs> I, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it a beam with you guys though. I really like how this outfit has these like Wrap strap these. like straps around like the legs with like the little diamonds to make it like blingy. Mm -hmm. That's what I really like. Okay. But see, I know for Trisha, like for me and you type, Mm -hmm. You wouldn't be wearing that because you probably would have had like a. Um, oh, like a little yeah. You're right. You would have had. Like, this is a costume, babe. This is not a lingerie. Okay, okay, okay. Let me keep my mind. Like, like, all right. Like you okay, okay. That okay, 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 <laughs> okay. Okay. So we now have outfit two ready. Come out, babe. Yeah. All right. See. <laughs> so it's kind of like a biker skeleton vibe. <laughs> but look, look what I did. You had to look at the details. It's like the same rhinestones on here as the mask. Babe. Oh. Sit down. Sit down. <sighs> oh my gosh. Ten? I'm gonna give this a 10. Is this like a better 10 than the last this one? This is definitely a better 10 than the last one. This is what, I, all right. So I know you guys are probably like, oh my God, Cam, your head is just in the gutter. Yada, yada, yada. Y'all gotta understand one thing. All right, first of all, let's look at my girlfriend. Right? <laughs> That's one. Two, like I said before, fish nest is five. And it got like the little blinging the on same going on. bling. But the bling is like a rainbow type of bling. And then I like the jacket where it had like, you know what I'm saying? You got some showing. <laughs> and then the back is just, golly, like. This guy, goes so 10. Yeah, I'm gonna give this one a 10. Wait, that's a whole entire, wait, what's those on your arm? It's like arm sleeves? Yeah, this oh. is a bodysuit I already had. Is that a jacket thingy? Yeah, it's a bodysuit. It's a bodysuit. You didn't buy that from? No. The only thing I bought for this outfit was the gloves, this, and the fish nets. I had this. How come you ain't never wear it? I don't know. I just have one. Probably because I would have ripped it off. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> I like this one. Yeah? yeah. Golly. All right, Trisha, I got the next outfit. This is the third outfit. Come out, babe. Let's see what this one's talking about. It's all them crazy. A little angel moment. Now, just to make it a little bit more seductive, the outfit. Obviously, I'm wearing like a little bit of a see-through dress, but everything's still pretty covered. And then you wear it with like a cute little bra. I feel like it would look better if I had like a white bra. Then we have a little ear cuff, a little choker, wings. Hmm, I'm gonna have to. Is so it supposed to be like that? Get... What, this dress? No, it's supposed to be like this. Oh, so you're just making it extra. Ooh. I'm gonna have to give this one like a... It's like a seven. Seven? Yeah. What gives it a seven? I don't know, it's just... It it's looks, just not fully like put together? It looks like it's like all over the place. All over the place? Yeah, it's like bent right here. Okay, that's not me. That's the quality of the product. It looks like it's all over the place. All over the place, okay. I'm gonna give okay, it a seven. that's fine. All right, guys, so we're moving on to the next one. This is the fourth one. I heard a lot of noise in the bathroom behind me, and I just hear a lot of noise in general. So I think that Trisha has something probably goofy on. So just come out, baby. Babe, no, I have to tell you something. What? This is probably the hottest costume I've ever had. Yeah, see, it already sounds like... No, like, well, I'm telling you. All right, <laughs> just come out, dude. Like, I already feel like it's something goofy. You always do this with trying on. Like, what is that? And why is Sky looking all around? Babe, what do you have on? <laughs> Yeah, see, I know. <laughs> I know you have something goofy, but yo, all right. 
Yeah, for laughs. For laughs. She always does this. She's been doing this like almost every try and haul. Like every try and haul, I gotta be ready because she always gonna come out with something funny on. This is kind of fun. I'm not gonna lie. I think I want to go trick or treating like this. Well, maybe we should keep that. So when we do go trick or treating with Kyla, you can wear that. Okay. She'll be like, Mommy, what were you for Halloween? Look, it's me right there in the donkey suit. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're moving on to the next outfit, which is number five. Come out, babe. Okay. It's definitely you know, more like a wearable going out. Yeah. It's still like cute. Like it has like the little opening here, you know. All these costumes, I'm sure you guys can probably tell. I like put all these together. You know what I mean? Like I had this bodysuit, my wardrobe. Really the only thing I bought here are these fishnets, this, and the tail. You know? Okay. Let me give this one a nine. This will be better than the angel. The angel was just like all over the place. Well, I'm gonna give it a nine. It's a solid nine. Thank you. All right guys, so this is outfit six. Trisha is ready. I'm out. It's a little bit of like a bad kitty moment. Definitely giving cat one. Okay. Ooh. I have a little tail in the back. I can't show you guys that, but a little right. tail in the back. I can't see. I can't show you guys that. I can show my see. man that. Ooh. I don't know if you noticed, but kitty got declawed on one finger. Ooh. So. Oh, you got in a cat fight? I got in a little bit of a cat fight. You got in a cat fight? <laughs> I'm liking this one. Honestly, I felt like you have in the past had an outfit like this, like Catwoman, but I feel like this one is like definitely way more put together than the previous ones. Mm -hmm. Probably like this one. Thank you. I'm gonna give this one, give this one a nine. Mm -hmm. I have to say, the one I really liked was the biker one. I don't the know. The biker one? The biker one was really the like, the, yeah, the skeleton biker. That one was really like, boom. Yeah? Yeah. I also like how like this one has like the, uh, the little necklace, the little necklace uh, little choker. choker belt thing. Ooh. That's all the hot Halloween costumes I have for you. So which one are you going to be for me? The biker? Yes. I want the biker. I ain't going to lie. Guys, comment down below which one you think was the best one. I'm going to say for me, I like the biker one. You definitely have to I like the one. biker one too. You're going to have to throw that one on. Oh my gosh. Why? It's Halloween. You got to walk around the house like that for the rest of the <laughs> day. But pretty much that is it for today's little try on haul. Like Cameron said in the beginning of today's video, happy Halloween, guys. We hope everybody has a great Halloween, is happy, safe, enjoying their time together. We're about to go enjoy our time together also with our baby and her first Halloween. Thank you guys so much for watching this try on haul. Don't forget to rate these costumes down below and comment down below what you're being for Halloween. And don't forget what we told you guys in the beginning of today's video about Homoglow. Everything will be in the description box. With that being said, we'll see you guys in the next lit video. Stay, Stay lit. lit. Peace. Peace.